So the final question is, is there a command line prompt for experts? And if so, where? And uh, I believe the answer for that is yes. If you go into Customize here and go to Options, you'll see the default workspace. You can choose the LTE workspace. And that slips it around into a TurboCAD command line type interface. We need to go and uh, turn on the command line. See if we're drawing some lines here. This uh, there is no command line as such right now. Um, let's see how do we turn on that command line? Is it one of these options there? Right. So then that can come up over here. I'm not sure what those options are there. I'm just going to drag them out of the way. Um, but yeah, now we have a command line over here, which is similar to AutoCAD. So we could type in line, for example, and then draw the line and then hit enter to finish. Um, or we can type in P line and uh, that's going to give us a similar functionality. And you can see that any of it's just type in now circle. And and you can get uh, you can see the prompt down here telling you what you want. So if you want um, uh, three points, then you have to type in the uppercase letters the three and the p. So you type three p, and then hit enter, and then you can do a three-point circle. Or if you want to do, uh, uh, you think if you hit the, um, you know, you can choose the command again, circle. And then you I want two, two P, so you go two P and hit enter, and then you can draw a two point circle. So it's all uh, controlled via this uh, workspace option over here, and then uh, this toolbar over here, which allows you to um, turn the command line on and off um, wherever that went. Uh, it might be a uh, Theme, dynamic input, show command prompting. I'm not sure how you turn the the command line on without that uh, that little toolbar there. This this tool here is called command line palette, and that pops up when you change the interface. And you can turn the command line on and off. Um, some people like this. I actually do like this interface, um, but uh, you might be uh, more familiar with the uh, standard uh, standard method in TurboCAD. But yeah, this does give you more functionality like you might expect from AutoCAD. And in addition, it gives you this inspector bar, which is stuff that you can hit tab to get down there and type in displacement. So if we uh, move everything to the right by 10 feet. We can just type that information in there.